this video tutorial I will explain Kafka architecture. Here you can see Kafka broker or Kafka server. Kafka server will be listening on particular IP address and port number. Default port number of uh, Kafka server is 9092. And uh, Kafka server can have multiple topics. And uh, we can create uh, multiple topics inside the Kafka server. And uh, each topic will have multiple uh, partitions. And uh, here you can see multiple producers and uh, each producer generate messages and uh, send messages to topic or uh, generate messages, publish messages to topic. Here you can see consumer group 1 and uh, consumer group 2. And uh, in Kafka system, there can be multiple uh, consumer groups. And uh, this consumer group 1 has uh, two consumers. And uh, this consumer group 2 has uh, two consumers. What consumer will do is, it will consume messages from Kafka topic, which was published by producers. And uh, this consumer 1, consumer 2 and uh, consumer 3 consuming messages from this topic and uh, this consumer 4 consuming messages from this topic. One important point is each and every consumer has to be associated with particular consumer group. Here you can see Apache Zookeeper and uh, Zookeeper is a distributed open source configuration and uh, synchronization service. As the name suggests, Apache Zookeeper is a configuration management system and uh, it will keep track of uh, Kafka cluster information and uh, it will keep track of uh, topic configuration and uh, also it will keep track of uh, which messages has been consumed by which consumer. Suppose say in this uh, particular topic one partition is added. That information will be sent to Zookeeper and uh, Zookeeper will inform this uh, information to this uh, consumers. Suppose say in this uh, consumer group one more consumer has been added. That information will be sent to Zookeeper and uh, it will maintain those uh, details. You can get the Java source code link from the description section of the video. To see the description in mobile, click on this icon and uh, it will expand like this. Then uh, click on this more button to see the description and uh, in the description you can see the links and uh, click on these links to get the java source code.